discuss the unique piece of salvage we recovered. For now, we've stored it in Edie's AI core. We need um, better that's not very to find the Reapers. An intact Geth would be invaluable to Cerberus's cyber weapons division. We'll have to disagree on that, ma'am. I saw enough of these things on Eden Prime. Space it. You've Cerberus never even you were never even on Eden Prime, you idiot. Cash. You're just a shepherd wannabe. I assure you, the reward is significant. Seriously, Jacob is such a shepherd wannabe. When I was talking with him, he's like yeah, I was an Alliance soldier, got uh, got swept under the rug just like you, Commander. All that crap. I'm like, dude, you're such a wannabe. Seriously, get the heck out. I've killed hundreds of these things, but I've never had a chance to talk to one. This one tried to communicate with us. Hell, it probably saved our lives. Why? Reactivating the Geth is a risk. If you do so, it should be for humanity's best interests, and not your curiosity. I still think our best interests involve an airlock. I want to know why it has a piece of N7 armor strapped to its chest. Battle trophy, maybe? Would a machine care about that? No. Trophies imply emotions that AIs don't have. I doubt it's more than a convenient field repair. I want to talk to it first. I'm not deciding one way or the other until I know what we've got here. I want to start it up. Them haters? Interrogate it. Sub if we you? activate it, there is no guarantee we can deactivate it again. Bullets can. That's, not That's actually I... true. Thank you, both of you, for your recommendations. I've made my decision. Tally's gonna freak when she hears about this. Yeah, she is. <laughs> so what about this Reaper IFF? I have determined how to integrate it with our systems. However, the device is Reaper technology. Mm -hmm. Linking it with the Normandy systems poses certain risks. Yeah. I mean... We saw what the Reapers can have the ability to do to organics, and the Reapers are synthetics. You can only imagine what they could do to other synthetic uh, creations like our Normandy ships, or even Edie. But, we have no choice. This IFF is the only way to get through the Omega-4 relay. Without it, we can't stop the Collectors. Understood, Shepard. It may take several hours before the IFF is ready for shakedown. I will alert you as soon as it is ready. Sounds good. Exactly, Until Zaya. Certain risks. Certain risks. Certain risks. Alrighty. Now I'm gonna go down to the AI core and actually see what the heck is up with the our geth that we have down there. I wanna chat with this thing. Alright, where's the AI core? AI core right here. In the back of the medical bay. That's not on my end, Natrix, it's on your end. Audio's fine on my end. Alright. Um, hi. I'm reactivating the geth, dude. I'm turning this thing back on. Be ready. Aye aye. I have isolated our systems and erected additional firewalls. I am prepared to resist any hacking attempt. you understand me? Yes. Are you going to attack me? No. Why not? Every Geth I met before you tried to blow my head off. We have not met. No, you and I haven't. But I've met other Geth. We are all Geth, and we have not met you. You are Shepard, Commander, Alliance, Human, fought heretics, killed by collectors, rediscovered on the old machine. Rediscovered? Old machine? Old machine? You mean the Reaper? Reaper. A superstitious title originating with the Protheans. We call those entities the Old Machines. You seem to know an awful lot about me. Extranet data sources, insecure broadcasts, all organic data sent out is received. We watch you. You watch me or you watch organics? Yes. 
Which? Both. Try refreshing it, Dark Soul. I'm not getting any desyncs on my end. Audio play audio levels are rising at the exact right moment, so it might just be on your guys' end. Try refreshing the page. I fight Gan. You do anything hostile, I blow you to pieces. Just so we're clear. We have no hostility towards you. Sure didn't seem that way at Eden Prime and the Citadel. You fought heretics, not true Geth. Geth build our own future. The heretics ask the old machines to give them the future. They are no longer part of us. We were studying the old machines' hardware to protect our future. What future are the Geth building? Ours. Will anyone else be affected by whatever it is you're doing? If they involve themselves, they will. Hmm. Are the Reapers a threat to you, too? Yes. Why would they attack other machines? We are different from them, outside their plans. Fair enough. So, you aren't allied with the Reapers? We oppose the heretics. We oppose the old machines. Shepard Commander opposes the old machines. Shepard Commander opposes the heretics. Cooperation furthers mutual goals. Hmm. I don't cooperate, I lead. Dang right. If you want to follow my orders, say so. Clearly. Otherwise, I'll rip your batteries out right now. We will follow your orders. Good. Now, what do I call you? Geth. I mean you, specifically. We are all Geth. What is the individual in front of me called? There is no individual. We are Geth. There are currently 1,183 programs active within this platform. My name is Legion, for we are many. Quiet, Edie, what the heck? I didn't ask your opinion, Edie. Christian Bible, the Gospel of Mark, chapter 5, verse 9. We acknowledge this is an appropriate metaphor. We are Legion, a terminal of the Gath. We will integrate into Normandy. Alright. <laughs> I love how he's like... We anticipate the exchange of data. He's like, um, how do I do this? And then he grabs my hands like, yeah! Shaking your hand, Shepard. Alright, one sec, guys. I'm gonna shut the stream down real quick just so I can see uh, if there is a desync and see if that'll fix it. So, one. Okay, good. It's lining up properly. Awesome. So, it looks like I just needed to restart OBS. Okay. Before we actually talk to Legion, I will be right back real quick, guys. Already, guys, I'm back. Sorry about that little um, technical difficulty uh, issue. Took care of it. Audio should be syncing up properly now. So, let's talk with Legion. Shepard Commander, we have completed our analysis of the Reaper's data core. Did you find anything useful? We were sent to the old machine to preserve the Geth's future. We are prepared to reveal how. The heretics have developed a weapon to use against Geth. You would call it a virus. It is stored on a data core provided by Sovereign. Over time, the virus will change us, make us conclude that worshipping the old machines is correct. So it's like digital indoctrination. Huh. So why did you need to go to the Reaper Corps? The heretics store the code in a quantum storage device Sovereign provided. To find and destroy the virus, we needed to understand its code and data storage structures. So, the virus would give all Geth the heretics logic, and all Geth would then go to war with organics. Yes, Geth believe all intelligent life should self-determinate. The heretics no longer share this belief. They judge that forcing an invalid conclusion on us is preferable to a continued schism. I thought Geth couldn't be hacked or get viruses, at least for more than a few seconds. Altered programs are restored from archives. New installations are deleted. This heretic weapon introduces a subtle operating error in our most basic runtimes, the equivalent of your nervous system. An equation with a result of 1.33382 returns as 1.33381. This changes the results of all higher processes. We will reach different conclusions. So the reason they worship the Reapers is a math error? It is difficult to express. Your brain exists as chemistry, electricity. Like AIs, you are shaped by both hardware and software. We are purely software, mathematics. 
The heretic's conclusion is valid for them. Our conclusion is valid for us. Neither result is an error. An analogy. Heretics say one is less than two. Geth say two is less than three. Huh. So it's like a difference of opinion, but they're both eventually right about the same thing. They both are correct in their own in their own individual um in their own individual viewpoints. Just the way that they view something is different. Interesting. If it were released, how quickly would this virus spread through your people? We are networked via FTL com release. Most would change within a day. Isolated platforms would remain unaffected until they rejoined the network. Hmm. You know where this thing is? The Heretics headquarters station on the edge of the terminus. We will provide coordinates. Normandy stealth systems are necessary to safely approach. Heretic headquarters. Sounds like we could end their raids once and for all. Let's do it. Total victory is a possibility. We cannot judge the odds at this time. Regardless, we will begin preparations. Hmm. Alright. Cool beans. Alright. Let's go get Legion's loyalty. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. It's from the Elusive Man. Yeah, I already activated it, dude. <laughs> We're actually heading off to do uh, a mission for it right now, so... A little awkward, Elisa Man, a little awkward. Help Legion, let's go. Kinda looks like a reaper. I want Legion and I want Tally. Be good to see conflicti conflicting opinions by Geth and uh, Ta and Corian. I want Geth assassin. Dang, he's so cool. What's up, Dark Soul? <laughs> Man, Legion's a beast. Just looking at his abilities, it's pretty dang awesome. You know, it's just our heat emissions that are hidden, right? They could look out a window and see us coming. Windows are structural weaknesses. Death, do not use them. Approach the hull at these coordinates. Access achieved. We may proceed. <laughs> I love Joker. He's so funny. Alert. This facility has little arrow gravity. Get require neither. Hmm. Won't we be detected? Don't they have intrusion alarms? Sensors have been reduced. We have infiltrated their wireless network and filled the data storage with random bits. And that helps us how? The heretics must scrub this junk data. 
They have partitioned themselves into local networks, working in parallel. Any alarm we trigger will not go beyond the room we are in. Only accessing the main core will trigger a station-wide alert. Hmm. We've got a job to do. Let's get to it. Shepard Commander, we concluded that destruction of this station was the only resolution to the heretic question. There is now a second option. Their virus can be repurposed. If released into the station's network, the heretics will be rewritten to accept our truth. Hmm. Either way, these Geth won't be a problem anymore. But Shepard, think about this. If you rewrite these Geth, they'll join the others. Legion's Geth will be stronger. Can we trust them not to attack us in the future? Why didn't you mention this before we came aboard? We did not know the virus was complete. It is. It can be used against the true Geth at any time. Our arrival was timely. They're your people, Legion. You must have an opinion. This is new data. We have not yet reached consensus. We will process as the mission proceeds. Huh. Yeah, rewriting them, it seems a little bit odd. Rewriting them would be kind of like mind control. We would be no better than the Reapers. Let's figure it out later. This isn't the time to debate. Ooh, medkit. Cool. It's down here. The Geth are inactive. Maybe we can sneak past them. Interrupting data streams will alert local network. We recommend preemptive strikes against hardlink routers. Useful resources in the Geth hubs. We could salvage them for supplies. Indeed, we Why could. Why are all the heretics attached to these hubs? These are mobile platforms, hardware. The crew is software. They are communing through the station's central computer. Hmm. I'm not sure I follow. The heretics connect to the main computer to exchange data memories and program updates. We gain complexity by linking together. To be isolated within a single platform is to be reduced. We see less. Comprehend less. It is quieter. If you exchange data, memories, how do you keep track of which ones are yours? How do you stay you? There is only we. We were created to share data among ourselves. The difference between Geth is perspective. We are many eyes looking at the same things. One platform will see things another does not, and will make different judgments. Many eyes looking at the same thing. Huh. If that's the case, is rewriting the heretics that big a deal? They're like a rogue limb of your own body. Rewriting them would be like reattaching a severed arm. To use your metaphor, they removed themselves from our body, took their perspective, their judgment. Their judgment sucks. <laughs> it's true though. You're worried that rewriting them would eliminate that unique perspective. It would, implicitly. Mm. That's a problem for you? Not every judgment made by the heretics was as poor as their aiding sovereign. The virus changes the probability that a Geth will reach a given outcome. It will affect all judgments, not just those related to Reapers. Let's keep moving. Yes. He's afraid of losing that perspective for the sake of his people. It's not necessarily, um... So much- it's- it's kinda like almost playing God in a way. And he doesn't want the Geth to lose that potential. He wants the Geth- we can assume they will assist us briefly, then self-destruct. The Geth want- I believe Legion wants the Geth to be as diverse and as unique of a, of a species as possible. And so by eliminating- Executing pseudo -clap. And so by eliminating a uh, potential- well, By eliminating potential viewpoints, that'd be kind of like cutting out a whole different viewpoint out of our- um, Out of uh, the political system of free Americans. That'd be like cutting out the democratic system. So we'd be left with only Republican, or vice versa. Assuming control. Assuming. Assuming direct control. Assuming direct control. We are the harbinger of their protection. Alright, where do we have to go? So yeah. It's more like Legion, from what I've understood, from what I've gathered, it seems like Legion wants to eliminate the viewpoints that could potentially harm the Geth as a species, but by eliminating this viewpoint, it will 
it'll both eliminate the geth, uh, a harmful viewpoint that will harm the geth as a species, but it will simultaneously limit the geth's viewpoints uh, to strictly uh, a set amount. So it's kind of like weakening the uh, the individuality, or not individuality, but weakening the. Hold on. Process. Oh. Assume. It would be weakening the Geth's, um, uh, freedom of thought, so to speak. Different viewpoints show to, to strengthen a species, but, uh, strengthen a, a species socially and strengthen the species advancement. This happens with uh, with humanity as well. If we didn't have different viewpoints and different ways of thinking throughout the world, then we would still would be living in the archaic, um, archaic, uh, archaic ways. So, like for example, if we still if we didn't have unique viewpoints and different uh, ideas and unique uh, ways of processing information and new uh, new ways of doing it throughout history. We still will be working with the basic hierarchy system, or ver or perhaps even the um, we uh, perhaps every every country in the world would be tyrannical because of that. I'm dropping frames like a madman right now. What the heck? That was weird. I just jumped to like two percent frame drop, just out of nowhere. Contact. You're dead. <clears throat> oh, check this out. I can turn it. Saw a geth around here. Keep on moving, I guess. Man, this place is so dang dark, but I guess Legion did say they don't need windows, and I'm assuming because they don't... Uh, the same thing goes for lights. They've seen us. Where? Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm dropping frames like crazy, so I'm just gonna save it right here, guys. And this is, it looks like it's gonna have to, be, have to be the end of the stream until my internet decides to actually get its crap together and stops ruining my streams. So did this last night too, and it's pissing me off. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I have been Crippled Walrus. You guys have been my awesome viewers. Thanks to my internet, I am now a liar because we weren't able to finish the game tonight because my internet decided to take a crap on my face. But, um, I will just have to pray that, uh, my internet fixes itself so we can actually play the game tonight. But I'll see you guys in the next stream, I guess. I'll see you later.